speaking. I've been rescuing cats for 30 years, and we have 24 cats living with us. It's like living in a cat aquarium. The cats are above us. Next to us, there's a cat right here. There's always cats somewhere. My name is Peter, and this is a story about my cats or geobeats. I adopt from local shelters. We try to adopt kittens that people don't usually want, like shy kittens, black kittens, kittens with minor problems. It just feels great that you can save the life of this sentient being. My house is called House of Neko, which means House of Cat in Japanese. I'm a builder, that's my main job. I built one catwalk, the cats loved it, and then I started building more catwalks and it became a kind of endless hobby. The cats can get to every room of the house in many ways. Cats don't like to be cornered. We give them two ways out. There are walks and tunnels and bridges and cubbies. They can find hiding places that we don't know, but they come back. I actually grew up with dogs, but uh, cats are more independent than dogs. When I bought this house 30 years ago, it came with two stray indoor outdoor cats. We kind of adopted them, and I got hooked on cats. <laughs> and since then, I just like cats. They give me more than I give them. You come home from a long day in the human world and you sit down and you're surrounded by cats and they are very calming. If I sit in a living room chair to read a book, in about 20 minutes there'll be 10 cats just hanging out. Which is cat therapy. I love all my cats. My most favorite was Cookie Monster. I lost her last year. I have cats that are not sociable. I have one cat, it took years before she would even come near me. I believe to let the cat be who they are. They don't all get along and we have a very complicated, ever-changing schedule of giving access to different parts of the house at different times. Sometimes two cats won't get along for years and the reverse happens. I have sisters who hate each other now and can't get along. So it's ever-changing. Again, you have to accommodate cats more than making them accommodate you. For the most part, they sleep where they want to sleep in my bedroom, anywhere from two to six sleep on my bed. We work very hard to keep our house clean. We have five Rombas that vacuum every day. We're in the month 14 of a very large remodel. We added a basement that's going to be a giant cat room. And even in the main house, we have ongoing ideas of more bridges. They will never finish. Humans are difficult for me. Animals are easier. They're more honest. I've been rescuing cats for 30 years. And five years ago, one of my cats was diagnosed with FIP. So I started Zen by Cat, which is a nonprofit to raise money to help those researchers end FIP for all cats. Cats rule dogs. There's something attractive about their independence to me. I have trouble going to shelters and not wanting to just take them all. I can't solve the world problems. I can't even solve human problems, but I can save the life of an individual cat, and, and that's something. <laughs>